Hi folks, I'm Ben Gilroy. This Friday, May 24th, I'm looking for your number one vote as MEP for Dublin. There are several issues we had to take care of, and I'm the man to do it. A lot of people are asking why I carry a hurley stick. Folks, elections are no more about between left and right. It's between right and wrong, good and evil. And we are really troubled in this country with state corruption. That's one of the things I intend to take care of if I come back here with the office of MEP. Folks, a lot of people out there don't know that the constitutional rights, both European and Irish constitutional rights, are being eroded every day by this government and the previous government. That sickens me to the backbone. And if I come back with MEP office, that's gone. Folks, this is another one. Stealing the country's wealth. This government and past government bent down backwards to vulture funds and bondholders and stole our wealth while children and families are on the street starving. It's not going to happen under my watch. Vote number one Ben Gilroy for Europe and I'm going to Europe to get our money back. <laughs> Unlawful evictions, that's a byproduct of successive governments allowing our country being robbed of its wealth. Families out on the street, people committing suicide. I'm going to come back as MEP and stand with you in court, making sure your rights are upheld. The way I've done without MEP office, I've even gone to jail for people doing this, and I'll do it again. People wonder why our politicians are not properly challenged when we've been robbed by successive governments and bondholders for the last 10 years. It's because of biased media like these. Remember, they have blocked me out of live debates. They're going to have the talkers on who do the talk. But remember, I'm a man of action. Bias media is going down. The choice is yours. Are you still going to be victims or do you want someone to fight for you? I'm the man. Everybody knows it. Pick someone who does it rather than talks and he has to be tough.